Chemicals can be severely corrosive to above-ground metal storage tanks, resulting in possible leaks. The average corrosion rate of some carbon steel storage tanks in certain services at ambient temperatures is more than 1 mil per year, with leaks developing in as few as 5 years. These leaks result in costs for both tank repair and possible environmental penalties. Tank corrosion sometimes increases when a layer of water containing soluble salts and chloride settles to the bottom. These compounds are highly corrosive in themselves, and they can generate a strong electrolyte that further promotes corrosion from within. There can be a problem with external tank corrosion as well. The bottoms of above-ground storage tanks are susceptible to corrosion, especially if the tanks are close to salt water or subject to stray electrical currents in the soil. If an above-ground tank bottom is corroding, it must either be replaced or coated with a thick film, fiberglass reinforced lining with a 60 to 65 mil dry film thickness. Since replacing a tank bottom can be costly and time-consuming, fiberglass linings have become a popular alternative for tank bottom repair. GRE lining is a significant application in the fiberglass industry. It has diverse applications including corrosion resistance structural strengthening and waterproofing. GRE lining applications can done not only in water storage tanks but also for sewage tanks, chemical storage tanks, crude oil storage tanks, tank roof lining, sewage sump pits, cooling towers, chemical plants and fire fighting networks. The recent trend has municipalities shifting away from replacing tank bottoms and toward the application of fiberglass lining systems where recommended. Installing a lining system means applying a primer, catalyzed resin with a glass mat, tissue, and a seal coat. The tank must be dry and the surface properly prepared. The entire process is quicker and less expensive than replacing an entire tank bottom. A properly selected and applied lining can protect the steel from internal corrosion up to 10 to 20 years. Thick film fiberglass linings are considered secondary bottoms that are bonded tightly to the storage tank. When properly selected and applied, they prevent leakage due to internal corrosion for 10 to 20 years. If the supporting steel bottom is perforated, these linings also can help minimize the problem of exterior corrosion by providing enough strength to bridge small perforations. Even if severe corrosion is present on the outside, it is possible to apply a double layer of the laminate for a total thickness of 110 to 120 mils. Linings of less than 20 mils dry film thickness will not protect against leakage from outside corrosion. They are recommended only for relatively new tanks with no internal pitting and underside corrosion. This picture shows the fiberglass lining application in an external floating roof crude oil storage tank. In crude oil storage tanks lining will be applied in bottom and first shell course. Because the crude oil contains highly corrosive water which contains hydrogen sulfide and other solid contaminants. Based on numerous applications over the decades, these systems have a proven history of successful performance.